newest ballpark on the Major League landscape. There's a look inside Marlins Park in Miami. Tonight it's the first of four between the St. Louis Cardinals and the Miami Marlins. Stay tuned for Marlins baseball next. Adam Conley gets the starting assignment for the fish in this matchup. What's your take on him, H? Well, Matt, he has really struggled his last three outings. The ERA totally inflated. It's over five. When you look at that, that's too many runs he's given up. And he's just not giving his team a chance to even get out the gate and win the game. Now at the plate, number 84. First shot for him here as he enters play, currently leading the senior circuit in batting. And he takes a pitch right down the middle. This Marlins ball club, Harold Reynolds, as they begin play here tonight. They've been on a real nice run of late, winning five of their last six games. They played good ball yesterday and pulled off a W. Let's see if they're able to keep that momentum going, play good again this one, and win another game. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. But that'll be off the wall in right center. Running hard, he's digging for second. And he'll make it in there with a two-out double. It's always nice to get something cooking in the first inning. Even Trying to pick things up where he left off. Number 84. Number 84. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at bat with another big hit right here. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Takes a look at a strike over the inside corner. A runner on first with two away. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field. And this one is gone. A home run. A two-run blast to straightaway right field. So his remarkable season continues. And the Cardinals are back within a run. It's now a 3-2 game. So we'll take one more look. And boy, he just continues to hit the ball out of the ballpark at an alarming rate. What a year. Ready once again, number 84. Already a home run and a double for him in this one. Get your pitch right here. First pitch coming, here it is. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. And that one is out of here. A two-run shot that gives them the lead. So it's a two-run shot to right center, his second of the game, as they take the lead four to three. One more time. He gets a pitch to handle. You have heard that before. And you can add one more home run onto this already impressive number. Digging in to try it again. Andrew Leading McCutcheon. He's 0 for 2 with right a strikeout in this one. Andrew McCutcheon. Changed up on him as this is grounded a second. He's got it. And a rather easy first out. Digging in and looking for more. Number 84. And it looks like this could be a critical at bat in this one. Well, a glance at my scorebook shows they haven't been able to get him out yet. So this could be a fun at bat to watch. And there's the fourth wide one. So he's aboard on the intentional walk. In now, number 84. He's driven in four already, and yet another big RBI opportunity for him right here. Matt, they couldn't have asked for anyone to hit better in this spot than this guy right here. He looks dialed in at the plate right now. And here's a fastball called for strike one. When you're facing this good a hitter, man, that strike one becomes so important to get ahead with him and make him think about something else. Now you can control the bat. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. Piscotti rounds third and is digging for the plate. They're going to extend their lead as the runner scores from second. And he'll pull into second with his fourth hit of the ball game. And that one will put him over the top. He's now broken the single season hit record. His 
crowd is going crazy as they should, recognizing the historic magnitude of really an unbelievable accomplishment. You realize how hard it is to break the single season hit record? You're facing lefties, righties, starters, relievers. This is one powerhouse season that he's had. The batter, third baseman, Martin Rado. Slider, and that's hit on the ground towards second. Reined in. Throw on to first, two gone. Ready for another chance? Tomas Talese. And Dan, what's the plan of attack here for the guy on the mound? Well, I think they have to go right after him. He's pretty unlikely to take you deep, but if you allow him to get on base, the chances of him scoring and tying this game become a lot greater. Scooped up, and indeed he'll not even try as he goes to first, and that means two men are in scoring position now with two away. Man, I don't care who you roll out there against these guys. That's ten wins in a row for them, so they feel like they can beat anybody in the league right now, and they're making it look awfully easy, too. And this one concludes at a 10-7 score. St. Louis with a division-leading 60th team win this year. Brett Cecil wins his fourth game out of the bullpen this year. So that'll just about do it. For Harold Reynolds, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. For more, don't forget to check out theshownation.com.